and then this was so sad. He fell out. I didn't know my I didn't know my damage at that point. And then missed input chat. Missed input. I don't think it's over yet because X Factor will be. Done. You these people in the back, you threw away the game. Why'd you do that? I'm fighting, I'm fighting one of the best teams in the game. Give me a second. Let me cook. Say hi to YouTube, because we're making more reaction content. Whoa, who loves reaction content? Anyway, okay. So, let me tell you about a time, uh, a time that I played a certain guy named Cloud805. Uh, Cloud805, for those who don't know, is the premier Zero May Cry player. There has been a lot of uh, Zero Dante Virgil players in the history of Marvel. There probably will be until the end of time, or until the game is no longer played. Uh, for that team, is that team is very strong, formidable, right? Offers a lot to the to the game and the landscape that the landscape that it paved for the for the meta in the future is undeniable, right? But Johnny, aka Cloud of Fire, was someone special. That dude was always just uh, a bit ahead of the curve. He always did some crazy stuff. His Zero phenomenal. His Dante the best in the business. His Virgil, and yeah, he's just an awesome dude. Who, who I love and respect. Really good homie of mine. We've done content together. Love that kid. Um, and big fan of the guy, right? Well, I'm going to take you back. In Phoenix, Arizona, there was this place called, I want to say it was Endgame. Endgame. I think that was the name of a bar. So it was a barcade. Barcades are usually where it's at for nerds that really just want to get down and be social with other nerds. So I, I went out to Arizona and uh, at the time, uh, we had been going repeatedly to this event called Undefeated. So this event was run by Armando. This guy loves Marvel. He's hosted events uh, year after year. And this year, there was a lot of national competition. So people came through from the East Coast, from Midwest, all over the place. Armando pulled out all the stops, whereas historically, it was just kind of like Vegas, West Coast, Vegas, Arizona, any combination of the three. But it kept getting bigger. So this was like the biggest one yet. So I rolled up with my homies. And uh, and I was I was very much undiscovered at this point. I would say like a few people knew of me, knew about me, and in my local scene, I had been doing pretty well for myself. And uh, at this time, we were really close with the Arizona scene, uh, so much so that my good friend uh, Rika, so she was she was running the bracket and also playing. But uh, we had all been really good friends, and uh, as part of our of the sister community, Vegas and Arizona. Uh, so this TO. Uh, that came up to me and said, Javi, you're up next. Um, and I was like, okay, sounds good. And then they're looking into the bracket, they're looking into the list, and like, da, 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 da. oh, we're gonna put that one on stream. And I was like, huh? Huh? <laughs> like, you know, playing on stream is, is, is pretty intimidating, especially if you don't do it all the time. And even after you do it all the time, I think I still get a little bit of the, the nerves myself. Uh, the pressure of playing like, in front of anyone and then people that aren't even there can be a little daunting. So I was like, oh shoot. Well, you know what? Fuck it, I'll, I'll make it work. Good luck to me, no worries. And then I was like, wait, who am I playing? She said, oh, Cloud805. And I was like, damn word, like that? You're gonna put me on stream? And she's like, you got it, you got it, you got it. It's gonna be a banger, don't even worry about it. Right, and I was like, all right, all right, fine, fine, fine. So now I'm shaking off some nerves and getting ready, getting pumped. I decided, well, if I'm gonna go up there, I'm gonna do my best. And at this time, again, I've been really, really unknown player. Like not, not a lot of people knew about me and even less people knew about my team. Uh, funny enough though, I had played Johnny Cloud805 before. Not in tournament, but I had played him before. And we played in like an after hours, like exhibition hall kind of setting. It was uh, on stream and it was very like, it was very casual, right? It was just, I just rolled up and we chatted and we had vibe before. Um, but this time we played and like, I ended up losing. It was really bad. It was, it was not, but it was not tournament, but I did lose like a casual kind of set, right? So I already felt the pressure. Zero is a tough contender. This is one of, this is probably the best in the business. So I mentally prepped myself and I was like, I'm just going to do my best. I'm just going to do my best. So I got up on the stage and this is great. The way it was set up was there was a center, center barcade, like almost a stage, kind of like what I have behind me. So like right here, this is the setup. And this is the stage. And then everyone, you kind of step onto the stage and there's like screens here. There's a whole bunch of people here watching, you know, on the side, Every, everyone everyone can very easily see the game. So anyway, we're coming up to, to my match. I jump on stage, I'm sitting next to Johnny, give him the fist bump, good luck. And and then the match starts. And then we play, dude. And um, 
This is on Xbox, by the way. So for some reason, I mean, maybe I'm just tripping. Maybe it's a fucking placebo. But uh, it, it just feels faster. I don't know. Yeah, this is on Xbox, dude. Back in the day. Because back in the day, Marvel 3 was only played on Xbox 360. And for a lot of people, that shit ran perfect. Well, anyway, I'm getting cooked, by the way. I blocked. I didn't do anything. I didn't get a punish. That was a charging star. I was very fucking sad. Bah. And and Johnny's just so good, dude. Look at these confirms. Like he was at he was basically peak in Xbox era. He was always making top eights. This is when he played on pad. This was this was a hundred percent Johnny and, and he was just cooking. He was cooking. No matter where he was. So you know, I got bodied. I got zeroed. I was like, alright, well got that out of the way. And and chat and I'll tell you guys real quick, nothing feels better when you're really stressed than just Getting your first L over with. I don't know about everyone else. Maybe it's a hot take. But when I'm nervous and I'm like, oh, dude, I don't know if I can do this. I get my first L and I'm good. And I'm like, you know what? What's the worst that can happen? I'll be all right now. I'll be all right. So anyway, now I try to take a different approach. Take the grab. Got Maya called out. I got my three pieces. I was like, okay, wait a minute. I got three pieces of evidence. So as you can see, I'm kind of, I'm getting better. You know, the situation gets slightly better every round. But... I'm fucking dead. All right, so there comes the mix. That was cheap. Fuck you, Johnny. Fuck you. I know you're watching this video. And then I got picked up. Chat, why did I get grabbed and I might die? Chat, I got grabbed. Chat, he grabbed me and the damage was skilled and I fucking died. I have half of the Sagamo for the income in. I'll stay in front. Nice one. Oh, oh, he got it. it. He dropped his combo. I was oh, so man, blessed. I like and I hit him with the because, with the oh, cheeky stuff. Is really, really, like, it's, it's pure and then I messed up my teleport. It was a failed attempt at a teleport, Ray Ray. And then I'm like, well, this sucks. I got hit. He didn't confirm. Oh, I like this. And I'm getting fucking glitch chat. Oh, just like that. And then the luckiest glitch, baby. Wait, he don't have enough. He's not gonna kill. And then I'm like, watch, I don't care. Nice. Oh, oh, There's nothing else he could do. So he's a thousand feet in the air, and he just supered. Bro. So I'm like, oh, bro, easy clap, easy clap. Like what? I'm just gonna counter super. I know my nice. frames. But then Ray Ray pointed this out. But like, he kind of got behind me. So Ray Ray made this. No one really got this because everyone was getting really hyped in the crowd, right? So like, this is my first win. Is literally like Ray Ray said. Virgil was here. If he had any more health, I probably would have fucked. He would have set me. He would have had a meter. He could have mixed me. He could have done anything. Yeah, he might have even fell out. It sucks. So anyway, now it's not. Now it's one one. Some people are looking. Luck is a skill. Facts. Facts. And looking back, I really would have loved. I would have challenged a lot more. Like threw a little more button. Swung on. Swung on zero. I'm gonna get unblockables again. This sucks, man. Zero is tough, but there's things you can do to, to make make the defense less awful, especially with Phoenix, right? I'll answer that later, Melkar. I jumped out, thank God. Fuck this noise. And then, yo, the dash. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Javi's movie was kind of Javi's movement on Xbox was kind of clean though. Check the shit. Wait a minute. Oh my God, take me back, dude. Take me back. Oh, I wish, dude. I can't do this on. I can't do this on Parsec. I can't do this on PS PS whatever, dude. I can't. I can't. It's not the same. I don't think it was the wave dash. Fuck you. Ooh, get out of my get face. Out of <laughs> people in the background, bro. Fuck out of here with that shit. Oh, this is so... Track. Like... Okay. Let me tell you. Like, if you can hear it on the stream, I can definitely hear it through my headphones. It was so hard to focus. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, exactly. Like Eric said. Yo, yo Edward, get next. I was like, stay away from my man. This oh, time I'm baiting you. I didn't have any good mix-ups here. I think I even messed up my mix-up. No, he just blocked it. Never mind. Johnny's so good, dude. Johnny's so good, dude. He fucking blocked my shit. I was so pissed. I don't know if you guys can hear. The crowd is not happy about this. They wanted the low-tier hero to win, but it was tough, dude. Johnny's Johnny's a contender. But people people had my back. They were like, yo, we, we, we like what he's about. Best of luck. They, they didn't know that I was okay at the game. I mean, I, I get the idea. You want to root for the loads of your heroes, right? You don't get to see them as much. And they usually have interesting kits, stuff like that. Just by just by not seeing them. Out of my face. 
Now the crowd was electric during this tournament. Because you're so close, the venue was so small. He was afraid of the eye, which is actually a terrible mistake, by the way. Grab? That was a grab option select. His head was itchy. Anti -air head itch. His head was itchy. Please, yes. And then this was so sad. He fell out. I didn't know my I didn't know my damage at that point. And then missed input chat. Missed input. I, I don't think it's over yet because yeah, X-Factor will be These people in the back, you threw away the game. Why'd you do that? Bitch, I know that. Shut the hell up. I'm fighting. I'm fighting one of the best teams in the game. Give me a second. Let me cook. So Ryan, I'll get my evidence. And, and he let me cook. I proceeded to put on the chef's hat. The dash back. He blocked it, but it don't matter. And then chat. Oh, he got him busy. Listen to the back. Bro, this is the crowd. Listen to the crowd, dude. Chat, I just want you to know that, like, right, right, right here, in this moment right here, as soon as I did this, as soon as I did this, I'm sitting two, maybe, a, maybe two inches, a couple, maybe a foot, maybe a foot away from Johnny from Powder Five. I am like, I'm that far away. I do this, I start stomping. I'm stomping on stage. I'm stomping on the stage, bro. That's what I started doing. I was popping off. I was like, there's no fucking way. I see Johnny in my peripheral. He's like, he's like flicking his hair. He's like trying to fix it and shit. He's like, God, I'm not composed. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get my homies to work. I'm like, I got to get away from this dude. He's powered up. But, but Cap gets hit. And I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I tried to challenge you. I'm just a human. I'm like, bro, there's space there. And it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I get hit. And, and Johnny, his zero is cooking me, bro. He doesn't want... He just got through level three by Phoenix, right? He's like, never again. Never again. So now I have to block or I'm dead. Or game's over. Amazing block. My D, my D on point. And I called the I. Can't combo. There's an I there, chat. Remember, chat. There's an I there. And then that was terrible. I should have level three. But it didn't matter. And he didn't oh. die, chat. He didn't die. Oh, he but the meaty. That was rude. That was rude. That was rude. And I knew. The, bro, the crowd is too much. The crowd is too much. It is so hard to focus. And right now I'm just like, I gotta run out the factor. I can't. I can't get happy birthday right now. But now I'm getting chipped anyway. You know. Oh. Look at, like, this dude's chipping me, dude. And I just, I just wasn't thinking. I should've got him out. Listen to the clock, listen. I fucked up my mystic sword. He fucked up the punish. And now it's over, chat. It's over. Not like this. Oh, he didn't build the crowd. He didn't build the bar. But wait, but what if, chat? I'm blocking. I know he's gonna chip me. I jump. I teleport. I, he didn't. He didn't block. I didn't punish. I lived with a pixel. I knew he wanted in, chat. Johnny wants in all the time. Justice, and at this point, like Eric said earlier, and you can't see it, I, it sucks so bad that there wasn't a player cam. Everybody rushed the stage. <laughs> People I didn't even know were hugging me, bro. I was like, yeah, 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 we did it, we did it, we did it. Like, I didn't know it was like estranged aunts and uncles. This may have started my Marvel career in a way that like, I can't even explain. I, I felt so I didn't know what to say. Like I was I was forever hooked. Maybe I was like somewhat hooked before, but I was forever hooked to Marvel after that. And then they talk about the game. But yeah, that was that was it, dude. That was it. That was my first ever I I think uh prolific fighting game win. I, I beat I beat someone who was super well known, very talented. Uh I couldn't believe it myself. It was it was so I, unimaginably amazing uh, to just first of all have everyone rush you at the stage like like dude what the fuck I, I'm sitting there like dude I can't believe what just happened people are like 
making me tremble on the stage. I'm about to drop my whole equipment on the floor, shake the whole TV off the stage, dude. Everyone's losing their shit. Get off the stage, there's too many people there. Like, it don't matter. It just, like, the love was there. The, the hype, the energy, dude. Ah, oh, dude, fighting game energy is just so wild. After that, I mean, it, people knew of me. People, people were aware. They're like, oh, you're the guy that beat John. You're the guy that beat Cloud. Like, you're, you're kind of real. You gotta be, right? You don't just, you don't just accidentally beat Cloud Eight Five. Yeah, thank you guys for chilling and watching this. Uh, I, I love giving the stories. For those on YouTube, if you got any feedback for me or any stories, and you think you want to hear from me or see from me, let me know. Uh, hit the bell, subscribe, all that good stuff. Marvel content is here to stay. I'm here to keep it alive with all these good people in 2023, still doing it big. Uh, you know, all the love for Marvel. Marvel forever. And thank you guys so much. Hold it. I just want to give a huge shout out to my patrons. That's right, I do have a Patreon. And if you want to support the House of Justice and all of the House of Justice endeavors, as well as the people behind the scenes, editors, artists, please consider supporting through the Patreon. Thank you guys so much. Without further ado, here's the rest of the outro. Take that!